So here we go guys, uh, we are done for our uh, control and uh, power wiring. So uh, now let's move to our uh, practical testing. So I have a single piece motor here, which is uh, 220. And actually this motor is a three speed motor, but uh, we will use only the low speed power main source. Power and neutral. Of course, uh, you can use also your cutting wire, but for me, just for a uh, tutorial, I will not use the cutting wire. So I have now I have line and neutral. Then motor power. So this is our our output terminal. So we will put our power source here, output source. neutral and the third terminal is earthing wire since I don't have the earth I will not connect also the earth for this motor for, for the testing purpose so we have the power already so all is installed all is load also 220 motors load here so let's try LCB main source power on Then we will check the power. So power is already here. We have the power already, and also the the control supply. Also, we have the power now. Motor is running. Now motor is running. As uh, I told you before, it's a low speed only. So timer off normally close and normally open now now it's on normally open position now if your timer rotating continuously on normally open normally close so this timer I do only for manual rotating because I if this timer is 15 minutes gap so it takes more time to energize the power so that's why I'm rotating this so motor is running now switch off timer motor off so that's it guys hope you will learn something about this uh, wiring for our motor control and uh, for my next video the same motor connection i will put the trip indicator run indicator and uh, uh, off indicator so i will i need to add some auxiliary contact from the contractor which is for uh, my next video so hope uh, you will watch this soon yes. timer on normally close normally open so that's it guys thank you very much and god bless